Okay, let's have a look at the Cortex Control. This fills a massive gap in their ecosystem and something that a lot of people have wanted for a long time. Kind of felt it fell a bit short without this, to be honest. This is the computer-based editor. All right, awesome. So it loads really fast, as you can see. And then we have access just to all our presets, as you'd expect. So we can just do everything in here you'd expect to be able to do, including real-time manipulation of everything on the Cortex. So for example, if I wanna just come in here and adjust things, you can hear that just changes as I'm adjusting it. Perfect, right? Which is amazing because I don't have to bend down anymore and I can just do things from my laptop. Love it. Um, obviously, this is a really, really simple rig up here uh, just to show you basically what we can do on the Cortex Control. So as we're adjusting things on our Cortex Control, so for example, the gain here, it is doing exactly the same thing on my unit, right? And although you can't see it changing right this second because it doesn't automatically on the unit show the actual amplifier controls. If I just press on those a second. So there we go, I've gone into my amplifier controls now. You can see that when I do move things like the gain here, it does move exactly the same on the Cortex, right? It is absolutely seamless. It is perfect, it is exactly in time. There's no latency, there's no issues whatsoever absolutely awesome job now to be honest this could be a really short video because everything you can do on your actual cortex unit you can do here right but it has got some really nice little features as well like being able to come into the directory up here and then being able to just drag and drop all your different irs straight in here which is great access to your cloud IRs up here as well, just perfect. Um, all your captures, so the factory captures and yours. So I've got a few here that I've done, um, including my uh, the Freedom BEOD Awesome and including things like the um, Two Rock. My Two Rock amp is up here as well as a few other things. But be able to access them easily from here. Fantastic, right? And my favorites, just brilliant. Back to the grid. Obviously, we can do things like our outputs. We can change that if we want to. We can change our inputs. We can change our grid wherever we want. Yes, thank you. Thank you, Neural DSP. We can now do all the cool things much, much simpler. Love it. If we go into what they say, then, you know, as it says, it's sleek, it's intuitive, it helps us optimize our workflow in a really cool way. Uh, boots in seconds, really easy. It does bulk actions as well, which is fantastic. We can copy, upload, download, and so on really easily on this and create backups as well. The internet is actually via the USB, which is brilliant because sometimes my quad cortex being on the floor doesn't get a great internet connection, but the internet actual, the actual internet connection goes down that USB cable so it's basically using the Wi-Fi from your computer instead, which is just brilliant. As we said, you can import your IRs and stuff there, just drag and drop them. Live tuner, audition devices. Oh, that's quite a cool feature actually, which I like. So if I pop in down here, I've got my tuner at the bottom here, right? So I can just see all the time down here whether or not I'm in tune. And then the other cool thing as well is say I want to just change my amp. So let's change it to something like, uh, let's change it to this one. Let's go with the Johns. This is a great amp as well. Great amp model.
And as we can see up here, it says that we're auditioning. We press escape to cancel or enter to accept it, which is just fantastic, right? I'm gonna hit escape because I don't want that one. And we just go back to the Victor Squid Channel 2. <laughs> Which is awesome, right? Because you haven't got to make the changes, you haven't got to commit to anything. We can audition things really simply and easily. I love that. I think that's a brilliant feature. Over here, it's on the facial fuzz. But, you know, maybe I want to just check out the green 808, push in the front instead. And again, we can escape to cancel or enter to accept it. Let's have a little listen to it. Let's boost that level. I don't want much drive from it. happy with that once so if I just press enter and there we go it's changed it I'm gonna save it as well though right what a wonderful update took a long time coming though guys didn't it? it took a long time coming but yes i thank you very much that's it that's it nothing more to add awesome 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 if you haven't downloaded it yet go and download it it makes life so much easier we can do midi yes thank you very much we can do our gig views down here there's nothing we can't do nothing it's brilliant Look at this, do our tempo, change everything that we want. We can do our global, we can do our scene. There's nothing we can't do on here. I love it, I love it. Excellent work, excellent. Right, how about you guys? Pop down in the comments, have you used this yet? Like I said, it's not new. I'm sure quite a few of you have been using this for a while. What do you think about it? Spotted any bugs yet? I haven't, no issues whatsoever, but maybe you have. We can even do our neural captures directly, neural captures exactly, just directly from our computer. I mean, that is so, so cool. Right, take care. See you soon.